Introducing the Project Manager. Access your project files easier than ever before. Sometimes you don't realize how much you needed something until you actually have it. And that's the case with the Project Manager, a brand new feature in FrameMaker. While it looks and even acts a bit like a FrameMaker book file, there are some features here that will really change how you work. The Project Manager gives you a scratch area of sorts, where you can keep track of all of the assets you use regularly. You can create folders, rearrange or delete files, and launch both FrameMaker and non-FrameMaker files. You can create projects using either the File New Project menu item or by clicking the Project button in the New and Improved Start screen. Inside your project file, it's easy to add links to your common resource files. Later, you can use the links to drag and drop resources on the fly into your FrameMaker documents. You can create projects for a specific book or have a more general file like I do here that keeps track of all of your commonly used assets. You can even reference a book in a project manager and reference a project manager in a book. In this book file, I'll reference this project file so that I can easily access it when I'm working in the book. Just like my template files, I'll choose to exclude this file so it's not included in processing and it's not included in PDF or HTML output from this file. Now I can quickly jump between books and projects and with the new project manager features I have all my files at the ready. If you have questions or would like more information, please contact us at techcom at adobe.com.